hey beauty so I'm back you guys all know this is your girl beauty by Nella So I'm gonna do a little quick unboxing. I'm gonna show you guys what I got. Well, a few of the things that I got. So um, first we're gonna start off with what's in this Morphe box. So we're gonna take this off. So this is what the Morphe box looks like from the inside, as you can see. You guys see all that good stuff. So one of the first things that I got was brushes. They're uh, called For Your Eyes Only Eye Obsessed, and it comes with 12 brushes and a little bag, as you guys can see. And let's see what's inside. So this is what's inside guys, these are all the little brushes, um, let's see, let's open it up and see what's in here, I'll show you guys what brushes are in there, so I have first, the first brush I have is this Morphe brush, and this is like more like a little fluffy brush that you could probably use this one for like, um, I usually use this for when I have like a nude shadow. And like I just want to apply it all over my lid, but I'll just use this one brush for the nudes, like the really light, light, almost color of my skin and shadows. That's what I'll use this one for. Next, I got like these little blending brushes. So here's one. And this is like more for like a smaller eyelid. This depends on your eyes. Like some people have like bigger lids, some people have smaller ones. Like this one, I could probably use it on my eyelid because it's not that big neither. So you don't have it's like for you to have work uh, space to work on to work with. And here's another one. So these are all blending brushes. And I really like this pack. I actually got this one for a really good price. I'm not sure how much it was, but I could check for you guys. And um, I also got one of these, which is for your, um, you could probably use this for your, like your, oh my god, I can't even. <laughs> you probably use this one for your eyebrows, guys. So if you guys want something like this with like a nice angle to it you could probably use for your, this for your eyebrows and then I also got this one which is more like a flatter one I think I would use this one for concealer like to conceal my brows and make sure like they're super clean you guys know all that uh, this one could also be used for your concealer or you guys could actually use this one you guys could probably use this one for your cut creases guys and this one for your cut crease I probably use that too um, this one, I'm not sure if I had already talked about this one, but this one I could probably use for glitter. And then I have this one, of course, which this is like to do your fine lines if you are doing a cut crease or just want to put eyeliner, but I would use this for a cut crease. So these are the brushes, guys. All of them. Uh, there was a total of 12, I believe. So I'll probably be using these on my customers when I got to do their makeup. Because they look like really good brushes that I, I would be able to use with them. So that was pretty much it for these brushes. And they, they'll probably stay in this little Morphe bag. Yeah. We'll probably leave that there. And the next thing that I'm going to show you guys that I also got. I had to go get another one. I had to order another one of the Jeffree Star uh, Beauty Blenders. Because, yep, my dog got into them. And you know how that is. She freaking ripped my Beauty Blenders apart. And she ripped my morphe ones and this one i had only had it for like less than a week and she ripped it apart so i had to order two more of these so yeah i got that too and then how much time do we got left next i'm gonna show you guys my all right guys are you guys ready to find out what i've always wanted it is the jaclyn hills vault guys it has all four of her palettes, uh, the tiny ones, the mini ones, guys. But yeah, this is one of the things that I've always wanted, and I finally got it, and I got it on sale, which is amazing. Um, I actually have one of the palettes that's in here already. My boyfriend bought it for me. He actually paid for all this Morph Morphe stuff, so thank you, baby. Love you so much. And um, the ones that come in this wall are the Ring the Alarm Bling Boss. Arm and Gorgeous and Dark Magic. The one I am looking forward to is Bling Boss. And I'm looking forward to Arm and Gorgeous. Armed and Gorgeous. Yeah, that's what it is. So this is what it is when you open it. Whoa, it's backwards because I did open it before I showed you guys. So one of them is backwards. But 
this is what it looks like when you open it up. And we're going to take all them out and I'm going to go each by one, one by one so you guys can see the colors. So this is the first one. This is the ring the alarm. And when you open it up, this is what it looks like and this is what it looks like from the inside. Look at that, guys. Isn't that beautiful? Like, oh my goodness. Actually, this is not the one I have. This is Bliss Bloss. Wait, what the heck? I put the wrong pot. Wait, hold on. Wait, I don't even think... I think they messed up, guys. Hold on. They messed up on the boxes. Oh, no, wait. Wait, why do I have two boxes that say ring the alarm? Oh, no, I don't. Whoops. Anyways, like I was saying, this one is ring the alarm. All right, guys, so let's do this one more time. This is the palette Ring the Alarm, and I'll take the little plastic off so you guys can actually see the colors. So this is Ring the Alarm, and they're so cute, guys. I have this palette already, so I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this one. I'll probably end up giving it away. And then here is Bling Boss one more time. This is the one I was looking forward to, which I will be doing a look and hopefully uploading it. Porque ya saben, I always do looks, and I don't upload them. And now let's see the next one. This is the uh, Armed and Gorgeous. I'm guessing this is a green one. Mm -hmm. What I say? It is. It is, guys. This is the Armed and Gorgeous. It's so beautiful. I don't know what Dark and Magic actually looks like. I'm, I don't remember. So we'll see right now. This is Armed and Gorgeous. Ooh, oh my god. Alright guys, so I think this is actually the one I was looking for. This is the Dark Magic. And this one actually has the colors that I wanted. So it has all these little green colors. It has like the nude right here. And as you can see, it has like the navy. So this, I think this is the palette that I was actually looking for. Not the Armed and Gorgeous, but Armed is Gorgeous is cute too. But this is the palette I wanted because I don't have any greens. Like... I'm looking for a variety of greens that I could use on like use on different kinds of looks and this one has it and they're matte so guys the next thing I'm going to show you is what are we gonna show you guys next I'm gonna show you the James Charles palette guys that I also got from Morphe which I ordered but I, sh I actually paid for that one so I'm gonna be showing you guys that one next Right, guys so next up I have the James Charles mini palette yeah so uh, I'm gonna open this up and I'm gonna show you guys the mininess of this palette <laughs> um, it actually is pretty cool it has a mirror so you can wear it you can take this when you're traveling I think I dropped a little paper somewhere but yes this is what it looks like look at this guys it's so miniature it's so cute someone's like take a picture screenshot this yeah no just kidding don't do that guys that was just be me being stupid okay so this is a tiny one and this is a big one can you guys see it this is a big one and this is a miniature one take a moment to admire this guys the big one, the small one. The big one, the small one. Because it was on sale also. I actually paid twelve dollars for this. I think I paid almost fifty bucks for this. Twelve bucks, fifty bucks. It's the same exact thing, guys. It's just tiny and it has a mirror. Um the colors that I mean I swatched some of the colors like when I first got it. And it's brand new, guys. It hasn't been touched or anything like that. Like, it's just swatching. I, I actually didn't even swatch these because I don't even see any fingerprints on here. Look, do you see any fingerprints? Because I don't see any. Anyways, it's the same thing. It's just smaller, guys. So if you guys like big and you guys like small, like, you could decide what you want. I like my palettes to be big. I, I don't know why. I just have, like, a thing for them being big. But, yeah, 
this would be nice to travel guys like if you're going out of the state I would take this this would be like a definitely yes because it actually has some pretty nice colors you could work with guys so now that I have showed you the James Charles palette now we are getting into the influencer box guys um, I have not opened it as you can see it is fragile it's a fragile liquid I know what's in here guys but you guys don't so I'm gonna open it I don't know what it looks like or anything I don't know what the box looks like or anything from the inside so let's open this up and see what the heck is in here oh my goodness all right so I finally got this to open up so guys what I have here is an hourglass box this is an hourglass this, they actually sell this at sephora or you, and it's from influencers you can see the box is so pretty guys and when you open it up what's in here all right so first we got a paper and it's a vial sheer magic it is a soft focus setting spray guys my goodness like <sighs> this is the actual packaging was oh, so cute um let's see the packaging is very simple. Um, I think this retails for about 40, 40 bucks. No, 49. I think it's 49. So about 50 bucks. Damn, it's heavy. Así no está quebrado. Alright, guys, so this is the the bottle. This is a vial soft focus setting spray, guys. It's pretty heavy. I'm going to spray some on my face so we can just see what it smells like. See if it's scented. Okay, whoa. So it has no scent to it. It's very, like, lightweight. Like, it's just like a mist. Oh, my God. Don't use it up, girl. It's, this is an expensive part. This should be for when you go to the violets. I'm going to stop using it. So it's going to be for when I go out on the weekends. Um, but yeah guys, this is pretty much the vial setting spray. If you guys want to, you guys can take a picture with me in it with it. <laughs> no, it's just kidding. Alright, you guys don't have to do that, but if you want to, like you can screenshot and send me some pictures, which I probably look ugly, but who cares? So guys, if I didn't mention already, this was from Influencer and they actually sent me this so I could test it out and try it out for you guys and let you know my opinion on it. So far, um, I've had it on my face for probably like about five minutes and not even five minutes. I probably had it for like three minutes, but so far it feels like really light. Like I don't even feel it on my skin. Um, this is supposed to, it's supposed, it's like a blurring, hydrating, radiant finish and it's vegan and cruelty free guys. So if you guys want to try it out, um, I'll leave the link down below or I'll probably like put it on the next snap or something so you guys can see. But yes, I would just want to say thank you to Influencer and hashtag Hourglass for sending me this. If you guys want to follow them, you guys can follow them on Instagram. Um, I actually have their foundation so I have tried uh, at least one of their products and I actually liked it. So yeah guys, this is probably going to be my summer thing. I'll probably be using this a lot so thank you guys so much. Alright guys, so I just want to say, if you stuck on to the last snap, which is this one right here, I just want to say thank you guys for watching, and I will upload these videos all in one if you want to re-watch it. It'll probably be on my Instagram, my, well it's already on Snapchat, it'll be on my Facebook, my Facebook page, on my story, so just keep a lookout guys if you guys want to re-watch it. And yeah guys, I love you guys so much, and peace.